my pretties. Welcome back to the Not So Berry Challenge. I'm Sammy B, and today we are playing the finale of Mint Gen. So, without further ado, make sure you subscribe and let's get right into it. Also, I want to say thank you to all of my subscribers who have been saying, yo, I'm watching every episode. I love you. I seriously, wow. Okay, so on a more serious note, I mean, not that that was not serious, because it was. Meliku passed away in last episode, but fear not, because we are going to use the Ambrosia treat and resurrect Miss Meliku, Mr. Meliku. So it's 4 a.m. I think the best thing we can do is uh, cry it out and send the kids to bed. I kind of updated their bedroom a little bit here um i need to get the little bassinet because our little bassinet baby is on its way in today's episode i'm sure of it so we'll send the kids to sleep and let's make sure mint is ready for her breakthrough and her promotion okay so i just bought mint a sleep replacement these are concoctions that she creates at work uh, I think it just works with the story. I don't ever use these ever in my Sims gameplay, so I thought it would be kind of fun to try them out right now. That is the point of this challenge, okay? So, Mint's feeling a little heartbroken, having her little... Everyone's crying in their sleep. Yeah. Ooh, pregnant lady is hungry. Yeah. I do think we have leftovers from Ruby's birthday, so... Which need should we take care of first? We'll take care of the shower, expert repair, and uh, feed our- Oh my- I was just gonna say, why is all her things green? But they turned red as soon as I looked at them. You wouldn't know, but I'm dead serious. Uh oh. Why did she- Why- What's happening? Why didn't she do a full bathroom use? That's weird. Okay, well, Mint, are you able to- Ernesto, go back to sleep, honey. It's okay. Let the pain seep away in your sleep. The kids are just absolutely shattered, crying in their sleep. I got so many things open in the background. I'm a little worried. I should probably close them. Yeah, hold on. I'll be right back. <laughs> okay, I closed a few things, so hopefully that runs a little smoother. I don't know why. It just feels like it's not running tip-top shape. Oh my god, the crying and the sleep is insane. Alright, sweetheart, let's take a thoughtful shower. Oh, she wanted to get some water. And that made the sink dirty. That's a rod. Okay, I want you to have a breakthrough before work, okay? Oh, that's just great. <laughs> that's just great. It's Christmas! It's Christmas. So... Hopefully tomorrow we can get that promotion. We definitely should celebrate. Well, I just wasted that. Uh, she could have slept in. I didn't even realize. Maybe you should watch the calendar, Sammy B. Maybe I should. Maybe I should. What is she doing? Contemplate life. What does that even mean? Does that mean like... I don't know. Mm, I'm going to keep this litter box because I know Malaku will return home soon once again. We, gotta, we should strengthen our bond with the... the spirit world that would help bring him back right i think so okay so she's just gonna have a big old plate of spaghetti for breakfast i can't say i've done that but honestly anything is is welcome in a time of grief oh wow she's actually gonna clean up after herself um i'm pretty happy with that so i'm going to get her to fl i know it i don't know why she would flirt with herself when she feels so like Sad. Just kind of clean up the house a little bit since I feel like we've been go, go, go. And it's time to just enjoy home life a little, you know? Mint Gen is almost at a finale and I realized that it kind of felt a little rushed at times. And I don't want the pressure of feeling rushed. So let's just have fun with it. Now Rose is awake and she's super hungry and yeah, wants to ask her mom for advice. I kind of figured. Okay, mom. I need you to be available for some advice from your daughter. Oh, she's so pregnant. Oh, they're gonna go outside and do it. Must have something to do with like, Meliku. It's probably about school though. 
Oh my gosh, they're going. They are going places for this. Oh, I hate how it cancels out. Mint, I need you to run. Oh wait, do we have a pea bush back here? No, we don't. Okay, I need you to run to the bathroom as fast as you can. And maybe we'll get Rose to just grab... I suppose she would... Well, I think the leftovers we got. Cottage pie? That's alright. Oh, Mint just made it in time to the bathroom. Thank goodness. Okay, we'll continue to get her to empty the bowl. Empty the trap. Wait, what did that say? Oh, rummage for bits and parts. I don't think we need that. Oh, this is going to be a really sad Christmas. Also, I feel like I usually get super decorated and then we kind of lose sight of that. Did we know we had this? The pedestal? Wait, don't we have this? No, we don't. Okay. Oh, yeah, we do. Why do we have two? Ernesto, maybe? Okay, well, we can sell it. We don't need two of those. <gasps> the Magnum Ignant. Ignant? Plaque refers to the rare sensitive magnum alloy created from mixing all the metals discovered in your collection. The Sim Geological Council, however, cautions against any sort of alloying done at home. Oh, I didn't know that we got that. Well, that's cool. Well, I think we should hang that right there. Mint would be so proud. Okay, so I'm just going to grab us a Christmas tree real quick here. Okay, it was the mintiest tree I could find. So we're going to... I guess it's already set up, right? I think we can maybe hang decorations together mm, we'll wait till everybody's away but for now let's strengthen our bond wait what does this do leave sugar skull offering i'm not sure but i don't feel like it's a bad thing Row, hooray. success mint's gesture of respect was appreciated the ancestors have heard her call and sent a day of the dead celebration to roam the neighborhood Oh my. Well, you might as well mourn Meliku while you're here. Oh, wish she were here. We're gonna engrave Meliku's tombstone that says, wish she were here, dot dot dot, and then that gives her the idea. Wait, maybe you can be here. Oh. Looks like everybody's awake. Rubes is awake. Rose is awake. She's not really doing anything. I wonder if, uh... She wants to do something for fun. Why don't we, like... I don't know. Chat in the chat room. Oh. We can strengthen connection to physical world. Okay, so it says Meliku's connection to this world is slowly withering. Soon, his spirit will be released and he will no longer be able to wander about and haunt Sims. Mint can plead the benevolent otherworldly spirits to allow Meliku to, to stick around for just a little while longer. Alright, so that should help Meliku come around. Hopefully maybe today. And that would be the best Christmas gift of all. I'm also going to get Mint to kind of take care, maybe harvest some of her crops. I believe she likes gardening, so just getting out outside, getting some fresh air, I think would really help her. Everybody is super sad. Rubes is cleaning up. I'm going to let him have his pajamas on for Winterfest. Okay, and guess who's in labor? Gardening made her go into labor. Well, that's gonna have to wait because guess what? It's time. All right, Ernesto. It's time. We should bring Ayla too. Oh, we can only bring one person. Okay, Ernesto it is. <laughs> okay, guys, we are at the hospital. It's time to check in and check out. <laughs> oh, poor Ernesto. Gonna go give himself a pep talk. And of course, he's gotta freak out. I wish there was another interaction, you know, like maybe like not freak out. Wait a minute. Why is everybody ghosts? We're only on first gen. Ernesto, you got this. You got this, honey. He's like, uh, not a fan of myself right now. I need to be better, in a better mood for Mint, my wife, who's giving birth. I need to be better for her. And I'm like, yeah, it's okay, Ernesto. You're doing amazing. <laughs> oh, didn't work. There we go. Now it worked. Oh, wait. Or no? Okay, what's going on? What's going on? There we go. Okay, what? Okay, here we go. Hello, my lovely doctor. Valerian Seeger. I think we always get her, right? Ernesto, I kind of want you in this room. 
<gasps> okay, I stop. I know I said it's a boy, but I changed my mind. It's a girl. It's a girl. She's also Mint's not really feeling any anything Winterfest. <gasps> That's such a glitch. Ernesto doesn't get them. Huh. Okay. What about the kids? Oh, it's a girl. It's a girl. <gasps> Red name. Red name. I'll be right back. <laughs> It's perfect. It's perfect. Okay, I'm not gonna lie, that took me way longer than it should have, but I thought of the perfect name. Ember, kind of like Amber, but I wanted it to really relate to like an element, like the flame, like fire. So her name is Ember Berry. I think it's such a beautiful name. He walks in, he oh, Ernesto, your baby's here, Ember. Wait, where is she? Oh my god. I think it's time for them to go home now. Maybe he can give her a little smooch. Oh, no. It's just time to go home. Okay, baby Ember. Where are she? Where are she? There she is. Let's just adjust that real quick here. Hello, little Ember. Help with needs. Oh, Ernesto's already on it. Ernesto? Find out what's wrong. Everyone's coming to take a look at the baby. Everyone's in here. They're like... Oh my god, look, she's thinking about her bed. She's like, I have to share my room with another sibling? Are you kidding me? She wants some attention. Oh my goodness. This is a... This is a really, really tough one, you guys. Okay, I'm gonna start with clear skies because I see some red on the rainbow. Oh my god, everyone's crying. Oh, you guys. Oh, we should get you to change out of your... I don't know. Some sort of dress or something for Winterfest. I know you probably don't feel like it, but I think we should all sing together as well. Come along, gather around the tree, everyone. It's Winterfest. Let's get our winter spirit on. Everyone's blue. Everyone is blue. Okay, guys, get your best singing on. Let's go. I loved it. Okay, let's do one more because that was fun. Oh. Uh, everyone's supposed to be singing. Everyone's like, Dad, we're over it. Aww. Well, Rose really likes present. Oh, she's going to go shovel snow like a good little cookie. Oh, yeah, everyone go do your thing. Okay, well, it looks like Ember. Sorry, she's new. Okay. Okay, yeah, she is in her new little fit. Looking pretty happy. She's got blue eyes. I don't know if they all do when they're freshly born, but I think she's doing pretty good, if you ask me. All right, well, we're not gonna do a big dinner because you know Mint doesn't like cooking dinner, so we're just gonna grab some leftovers. Ernesto might as well grab some leftovers too. Actually, you know what we should do is like pull out the table and have more chairs. <laughs> What's Rose up to? Is she still shoveling? Aww. She's gonna go ask for advice. Yeah, probably will go away by the time she gets there, but worth a shot. So Ruby loves Santa and presents, and Rose loves the same thing, Santa and presents. I know that this is a nice relaxing episode, but we still need to get a breakthrough. So Mint, I'm gonna need you to call like the, ho the sadless hot line or something. A balanced meal. Someone said eating dirt was okay, but someone else said eating dirt will make you die. Is it okay to eat dirt? Because Ernesto is a scientist, I think he would be straight up with her and say eating dirt is actually really unhealthy for you. Who the heck would be calling? Tony? Tony is calling him? Oh my gosh. Oh, okay, I'm gonna get... Uh... Actually, I'm gonna get Ernesto to invite over Reese. Actually, I'm sorry. I'm... Okay, wait. I think Rose would call Reese. That's cute. He's got a little Santa hat on. And then tell him, like, what happened. And then maybe invite him over. Okay, and then I'm going to get Mint to just read a book. We'll do Love in the Time of Sandwiches. It's a romance novel by Hancho Sorgazin. Tiny Tino and Gina are in love, but Gina bends to pressure and marries another. Devastated, Tiny Tino finds solace in a love affair with sandwiches of all shapes, sizes, and flavors. Many years later, Gina becomes a widow. Can she love Tiny Tino again, especially now when he isn't so tiny? I really want to get 
this social butterfly thing done but before she ages up. Very important to me. Oh, he's cleaning up. Oh, okay, so for WizKitty is to play three games of chess so we can either go to the park or get a chess set and read with an adult for two hours. Who's this? <gasps> hey, it's Lillian. Well, why don't we go spend some time with Lillian? We are still excited for... I wonder what we can give her. We can give her... This guy, the little purple pursuer action figure. It's purple. It doesn't really work with our <laughs> color scheme anyways. Give our friend a gift. Look at her on in her little pink outfit and her little pink Timberlands. Adorable. Our little redhead friend. <laughs> like, oh, thanks for coming over for Christmas. Okay, let's go talk outside in the snow. Aww. Ernesto's like, what are you kids chatting about out here? I'm like, Ernesto, they're fine. Yes, Mid got her 18th breakthrough. She wrote down an idea for Fixer's Lux Serum. Okay, what do we need for that? We need... Do, do, do. Oh, sorry, not that. Although we should get spinach for the need fixer. That could come in handy. Fixer's Lux, any upgrade part. Oh, okay. We should also see... If, wait, we do have apples. But I was just... Oh my goodness, there's so much going on. A missing toy. I was thinking about one of my favorite toys and I can't find out. Oh, what if that's the one Rose just gave away? Um, who is he asking? He must be asking mom. I think she would say, just play with a different toy. You have lots of toys because they do. All right, let's order some groceries. Oh, what's going on here? Uh, a teenager is asking if I want to go to his house and hang out. I don't think she would. Uh, just for multiple reasons. So... Let's just order some groceries. Whoa, we got a lot of money on our day off. Okay, I'm going to get some more apples just because. And then we were also looking for chrysanthemum, which I don't see here. All right, so officially Mint has all her breakthroughs ready to go to work tomorrow. Let's make sure that she's in bed by 12 a.m. I know that's a little extreme, but she does work at 10, so that's all right. She is gonna, yeah, order groceries on her phone. Hey, wait, where's your friend? Oh, she's helping clean up. I'm gonna get a chess table to help out. Actually, I was gonna get a chess table to help out Mint get her breakthrough and then they could play with, like she could play with Ruby together. But I think, I think she would get him a chess table uh, just for fun. Honestly, since we don't cook very much, we're just gonna put it in the kitchen. I know it's a little extreme, but I'm going to get him to play some chess with dad because I think that would be like a fun little thing that they would do. I know, I know this is a little out of place, but for now, like, you know, when it's Christmas time and you set up like board games and the house is always arranged differently. Just think of it as that right now. It's temporary. Okay, Rose, I know you're really sad, but your friend is somewhere here and I think we should hang with her what if we built a snow what if we had a snowball fight with her okay oh and then Ruby acquired the logic skill so that's exciting and mental skill level two and mint's gonna accept the delivery Rose is coming outside she's so not having it but I guarantee you it'll be worth it how come Santa isn't here yet Okay, I'm gonna keep my eye on this grocery thing because why do they always get lost, you know? If you watch my other series, The Pack Legacy Challenge, click that link above after this video. Yeah, it is, it is a thing. Oh, where is she going? Or are they, okay, they're still playing. Look at them play together. This is cute. Look at Rose just not having it. She's like, I really don't want to be doing this. <laughs> maybe if they just built a snowman, maybe she'd like that a little bit better. She's just so darn sad. At least she got to throw one. Aww. Ooh, that's a really loud cry. You got this. The boys are playing some chess. And I think Ernesto is actually having a really good time. Rose and Lillian are playing in the snow, making a snowman. I think this is a really good Christmas. I think everyone should go to bed soon. I'm really surprised Santa isn't here and a little disappointed because they really needed that to cheer them up. But 
Yeah, he's gonna go cry it out. Oh my goodness. <gasps> Speak of the Santa! Santa's here! Go give yourself a friendly introduction! You guys, everyone needs a turn. Well, the kids for sure. Okay, Ruby, you're first because you're the youngest. Hello, Father Winter. He's like, oh, these guys could use a new fridge. <laughs> They're like, no, we like it. It's mint. Oh, there we go. Look at how um, playful she is for making a snow friend. Okay, now it's time to share your Winterfest excitement and ask for a present. And he can also friendly introduce himself to Lillian. Might as well introduce himself to her friends. Rose's friends. Oh, she's leaving. She's like, oh, yeah, 10 o'clock is curfew. I gotta go to bed. Okay, what are we gonna get for a present? He's like, for me? Present. What? I love it, Santa! I love it! Thank you! Just like have a seizure. <laughs> what did we get? Amateur hour child's violin! Hey! Alright! That's awesome! Oh, I think he has homework to do before school tomorrow. Do you mind? I'm sure someone will help you with your homework. Okay, now it's Rose's turn to ask for a present. Because you were such a good girl. She's like, oh my god, I love it. What is it? Yay! A Blarfy! Thanks, Santa! Hey, that's not so bad. Aw. Oh, she just got really sad. And playful now. Do you think the parents should ask for something? I mean, like, could. Oh, remember the last time that happened and er, uh, Father Winter gave Mint like something really bad and Ernesto was going to fight him, but then he left before he could fight him? That was crazy. That seems like so long ago. Oh, I thought he was talking to the ghost. He's just admiring. Or sorry, mourning. No, not just. Sorry. Can we ask for a gift? Okay, Ernesto, you got to go ask for... Hey, don't take my catnip! Hmm. He just wants to chat. Who's that? It's a cute outfit. Oh, Ruby's done his homework. I guess nobody helped him. Okay, Santa better get us good present or we're fighting him. Them are fighting words. Oh, <laughs> <gasps> he hated it. He hated it. What was it? What was it? Ernesto, tell me. He got a future cube. Okay. Because he was on the naughty list? <gasps> no! I was just going to fight him! <laughs> you... That's it. It's personal, Mr. Father Winter. It is personal. So the kids are up because the baby is up. So that's kind of rough. This is going to be rough. going to get them to go back to sleep. <laughs> Baby's up again. This is not going to go well in here. This is not going to go well. Definitely going to have to get the kids to sleep somewhere else. Or sorry, definitely move the baby somewhere. And Mint is going through a midlife crisis. Okay, early midlife crisis. Life seems to be passing Mint by these days. It's the same thing day in and day out with nothing really to show for it. It might be time for a change. Um, no. You just had a baby. You're just about to have a promotion. I really don't think that that's how you feel. I'm sorry. I really don't think so. Oops. That was his interactions. I need Mint to be well rested for today. She is up and about. She's going to take a thoughtful shower and yeah, definitely shower. She'll probably fix her tooth too because she does care about her appearances. I'm still working on that relationship with Reese. Whew, this is a tough one. <gasps> okay, so she's going to have a quick meal of some cheese crackers. And then we're gonna keep texting. Oh, Ruby has a loose tooth now. Okay, we're gonna get Ruby to kind of do the same thing. He's gonna have a brisk shower, as well as grab a quick, quick meal of some cheese crackers. Copy his sister, of course. Look at Rose taking care of the house. She is such a good chicken. School starts in an hour. Both are done their homework, so not really a problem there. Hey, you're good. You're good. You don't have to keep doing that. That's fine. Oh, <laughs> Reese is calling her. Well, let's go hang out then. 
She's like, well, no, I got school. <laughs> but we can call and chat with him. I I don't know actually who she just called. Look at him all dressed up for his first day of school. Oh, yeah. Oh, no. He is going to have a bladder, bladder failure. Holy crap, he didn't. She loves shoveling. I hope that works on fitness because trust me, it is tough shoveling. Yeah, it's working on her motor skill. Good. All right, time for school, everyone. She's going to study hard, and honestly, I think Ruby would too. He seems like the type. Ernesto can grab something to eat. Some cheese crackers. Everyone is going to have cheese crackers today. There we go. Baby's asleep. Baby's asleep. I repeat, baby's asleep. Okay, let's clean up and kind of throw away some stuff here. And work starts in an hour, so let's make sure Mint is well fed. Wow, Ernesto just got a breakthrough too, so... I mean, I'm going to make him work normally, but that could definitely help him. Mint, I know! You didn't even get to go to the bathroom! Alright, first thing we're going to do. Tinker. Then, we're going to take someone's DNA. I think Ayla would let us... Whoa, that was fast. Okay. <laughs> Whew! Um, excuse me. Did Ayla retire? Are you joking? No. Oh god. She's like, hi Hector! We have met before, but I was wondering if I could uh, get your DNA. Please. Why are you in your hospital gear? Girl! Oh, he said yes, thank goodness. Um, shoot. I don't, we don't even have the option. What do you think she would wear today at work? That looks cute. Let's do that. Okay. Unfortunately, she, uh, she, I always go upstairs to go to the bathroom, but I always forget that there's a bathroom right here. So maybe we'll just use the main floor one. Paka! No! Me first! Paka! We need this promotion more than you! He just pranked it. Are you joking? That's it, Paka. You're next. We're gonna mind control her to change outfit uh, into her everyday wear. I wonder where Tony ended up. And then we're gonna freeze her. And then, Paka, you're next because you pranked the toilet. And then we're gonna freeze you. Hector was good to us. I wonder if we could find someone else. No one else? Okay, Hector it is. Mint doesn't care. <laughs> Listen to that laugh. She does not care. He's like, it was a joke. It was a joke. <laughs> She's like, yeah, I know. I don't care. It's Ember's birthday. Oh, wow. Okay. Okay. Let's see if we can mix this spark drive serum. Of course not. Of course not. Okay. Drink or give away a neat fixer serum. Well, you know what? We actually have that in our pocket and we're not pregnant. So we're going to just quickly drink that. I wonder if it would work. Let's see. Ooh, those are pretty green. She is kind of happy. All right. Well, uh, she has to read a book. So we could do that while everyone's still thawing. Let's see. Lucas Dark and Lucas. Yeah, Lucas Dark in the increasingly unlikely series of coincidences. It's a mystery novel by Lucas Dark. This gripping mystery tells the tale of Lucas Dark, an exceedingly attractive author with nothing left to lose but his mind. Written by future award winner Lucas Dark. But this, this, but wait, this, that's the main character's name too. What a coincidence. Okay. We're, uh, we're reading it. Sorry. I'm gross. Where are you going to read that? Up front? She's like, yeah, I'm getting that promotion, so... Just gonna read girl you gotta do better than that come on average promotion i mean average performance no absolutely not midlife crisis alert Mint has hit the breaking point in life she feels like her life hasn't been very successful probably like how have i how am i not maximized my career yet that's probably what she's freaking out about and she wishes to change things starting now on the plus side mint will gain a career performance bonus during this period huh get out midnight crisis desires and Complete them to decrease duration of the midnight crisis. Go to work focused. Put money in, into a vault. How do you do that? 
Oh, wow. Mint. Maybe she's like, after I've done this, I think I want to get into business. Like, okay. Okay, Mint. Okay, let's crack her open, and then we can order her to experiment. Uh-oh. Why did she change skin color? Who's that? Eliza, why did you change skin color? Can we talk about aliens? Okay, we gotta gra crack these peeps open because we got stuff to do. We can't do the spark drive serum because we have everything we need for every other serum except for that one. Makes sense. Definitely staying late tonight. But it said it would give us a boost, so that better be true. If we get this promotion... If we don't get this promotion, I swear! Okay, Paka, I need you to experiment. Right now. Right now. She's like, do you mind experimenting for me? That would be great. Okay, can we mind control somebody who's already being mind controlled? Mind control to clean. I think we already mind controlled her to clean, but we're gonna do it again. Just to make sure, you know? This also would count for this one as well. If we get this bar checked off the list, I believe there's a high chance. Especially since we have that like promotion thing you know okay so let's prevent abductions and then also use the sim ray on someone else we did it we did it we got the bar all the way to the end i don't know if staying late would actually help honestly we're not gonna stay late because every time i do i don't think we've ever gotten a promotion i think we're better off just getting more and more things checked off our list okay paka's coming upstairs so we're going to use oh man Oh man, shape the bonsai tree. No, something's telling me to stay late. Ah! I gotta follow my instincts. I gotta follow my instincts. <gasps> and Ernesto got promoted. I didn't even make him work hard. That's great. Oh God. Okay. Oh sh shoot. Gotta make this guy ravenous as well. Hurry, 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 hurry. We need to make you ravenous, Mr. Hugo. Hugo, please, 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 please. We need this. Oogaloo. Oogaloo. He's like, oh, I'm so hungry now. <laughs> oh, guys. I am doing I'm doing this as, as good as I can. <sighs> we have one more hour. It says that we that analyze a metal. We'll do Elkron real fast. Should have time. Hopefully. <sighs> <sighs> guys. I think we did it. I think we did it. <laughs> no! <laughs> no! No! <laughs> I don't know what to do. Do you guys think I should just get it done? Or do you think we should just do like one more day? Like what? Okay, just hear me out here. Hear me out here. What are the chances that it just happened to be Winterfest? What are the chances that my phone is literally about to die out of memory? I think we're going to have to do one more episode. I'm sorry for the teaser. Thank you guys for watching. We are going to finish this off in the next episode. I love you guys so much. I'll see you in the next one. Bye, guys.